Hey guys, my name's Jesse or JGame, and welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about Fallout 4's next gen update, where we got some secret weapons that you may have not known about. So in the quest when pigs fly, there's a vendor that sells a bunch of ammo, from baseball launcher ammo, to the piggy bank fat man launcher ammo. You can get literally any type of ammo from my guy Shugs here, so make sure you guys go check him out. Now two guns that he's selling that I didn't see in the update notes are the saw gun and the nail gun, and you can purchase both these weapons from Shugs. A lot of new Vegas players are gonna love this. You guys tell me how much you love this gun and then you guys can only access it through mods playing Fallout 4 but with the next gen update they added it in the game so you don't have to go through mods. Now I tried out these weapons and honestly they weren't the best things ever. The nail gun has a little bit of ammo and honestly it does kill people right away in the head but against legendary enemies it barely does anything and then you got the saw gun where I like this weapon better because because you can actually shoot the saws and then pick them up when you kill your enemy. So make sure you guys pick up your saw blades. It's like having unlimited ammo. Same with the baseball launcher as well. I made a video talking about the baseball launcher, which is one of my favorite weapons in the next gen update. And if I'm being generous, one of the best weapons aside from the Tesla cannon, obviously that weapon is totally OP, but it's cool to see the nail gun and the saw gun in this next gen update. If you guys didn't know about these weapons, now you do and you guys can go purchase them right now after you do the quest when pigs fly now I got a little question for you guys let me know in the comment section below what do I do to make these guns better the nail gun has so much praise in the fallout community but when I used it just now I'm like oh this gun isn't really that great so what mods do I have to do I checked out the workshop bench where you can uh, mod your weapons and see what attachments I could add to the nail gun and the saw gun there's a lot of things you can do from sights and recoil and all that so let me know what you guys think is the best way to go for the nail gun and saw blade gun so I can get like the best damage and the best range and everything and let me know how to make it a beast. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, hit that notification button so you never miss out on any Fallout 4 videos that I make. You guys can go check out my other videos in the end screens here. Till then, I'll see you guys in my next Fallout 4 video. Peace out.